Hello, my lovelies. Welcome to my channel. Here we are doing the monthly reading for all zodiac signs. This is going to be for Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rising. I do want to give you guys a quick update. I am going to promise you guys that I'm going to try the best I can to upload from here on out every Tuesday and Friday. So you guys don't have to wait for the notifications or you don't have to guess when I'm going to be uploading as I'm going to stick to that regimen of every Tuesday and every Friday uploading you guys new videos, okay? So without further ado, let's get into your reading, Leos. Let's see what Spirit has for you guys for the month of June 2018. This is going to be for Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Let's see what Spirit has for you guys. I'm feeling very giddy. So I feel that for a lot of you guys. <laughs> oh, I love when this happens. So the Empress actually popped down. Okay. I'm going to pull this to the side as I'm going to tap into those energies. But I want to continue shuffling. Um, again, like I said, I'm feeling very giddy. I feel that for the month of June. If you guys have felt like almost like you haven't been as energized and as Leo as you usually are, you're definitely going to feel for the month of June, all of that quickly start to shift and you're finally like preparing yourself to come into um, your sign basically. So again, I definitely do see you guys very excited, very enthusiastic about life. Uh, that's definitely a beautiful thing. Okay. okay, so for your general energy for the month, <laughs> for the month of June 2018, Leo, this is your card, my darling. You guys have the King of Wands. King of Wands is all about confidence, but also power. This talks about, as a general energy, it is past and passing. So it could be that for the end of May going into June, you've already been experiencing this, where you're more empowered, you're more confident in yourself, and you're like demanding that attention, that attention, sorry, demanding, um, you know, for people to take notice, uh, I see you guys like very Leo. I see you guys tossing your hair, uh, you know, for men pumping your chest out. I definitely see that. So again, I feel that for a while, perhaps you guys have been like kind of, uh, and for the month of June, you're definitely going to be coming into your own again, definitely very ignited, very, very passionate. Um, as I'm feeling very, very fire type of energy for you guys. So let's get into the first card that popped out the Empress. So the Empress definitely talks about a lot of abundance, stability, and creative type of energy. Now is the time to tap into your creative outlook. For some of you guys, for those of you guys out there that are very creative, that are into writing, are into poetry, are into making music, now is the time to really, really sink your teeth into that because you're going to be very creative for the month of June. Um, you're going to be very, very inspired. And I feel that summer is definitely igniting uh, that passion within you, that your flame is like just flickering very strongly. Uh, so that's definitely beautiful, beautiful type of energy. Your next card here is the two of uh, pentacles. So the two of pentacles definitely talks about balance. It also speaks about, again, next to the empress, um, if, you know, for the month, for the previous months, you've been feeling like you're a bit unstable, you're not really finding, um, and not having enough time is what I'm hearing. So for some of you guys, you guys may actually be working a lot of hours and just not being able to find that balance. I definitely do see you guys like not really caring for the month of June, like um, almost like, yes, I have to work, da, 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 da. I have to take care of this. I'm going to do this and I'm going to do that. But I will also make time to go out with you guys, to hang out with friends, whatever it is. You guys are finding the balance or going out of your way to find that balance. Your second card here is the Magician card. Very beautiful card, Leo. Um, so the Magician is all about actually manifestations. It talks about having all the elements or having all the supply, all the things that you need in your life to be able to progress and move forward. Let's see what Spirit has for you guys. Okay, so for the month of June, again, like I said, I definitely do see, um, I do see you guys very, like, really focused on what it is that you want and like not you're very blunt for the month of June and you're unapologetic. You are not like apologizing for speaking your mind, uh, your mind. You're definitely coming again. I feel there was something about confidence for you guys for the past couple of months. And finally, like, I feel that finally you're going to be able to, you know, really believe in yourself and speak up whenever you have to speak up and not apologize for it. Um, 
even if I know Leos could be extremely loyal to friends and sometimes you guys tr try to be a little too nice. Um, but I feel that for the month of June, it's like, if you have a friend that continuously keeps breaking up with the partner and you don't agree with it, but you're nice about it. I feel that for the month of June, you're going to be like, okay, you know what? Things are not changing and you're not wanting to change. You're going to be putting up with that type of nonsense then go ahead, but don't come and ask me for advice and then do the opposite. I feel that that's going to be your, your attitude for the month of June, very snappy. Um, but this is very good energy because this is your energy, Leo. So your next card here is the page of cups. Page of cups is all about manifestations with the water. Okay. So I definitely do see a lot of abundance and a lot of manifestations happening for you guys in regards to your finances. For some of you guys, it could be stepping up the ladder, going up, and actually getting a promotion or an opportunity that just lands on your lap, like just plainly falls on your lap, you're not expecting it, and you challenge yourself and you actually apply or you actually go for that interview um, that your supervisor just recently walked out of that work or whatever it is, and that opportunity is definitely given to you and you're like, oh my God, okay, like I was not expecting that, but I definitely see that for the month of June for you guys. A lot of unexpected news for some of you guys, it could represent Again, being able to find common ground and find balance for those of you guys that are in a long-term committed relationship and you have children, perhaps you feel like you haven't been giving them enough time because you're always constantly working. I feel that for the month of June, you're going to be like, okay, you know what? I am not working overtime because I need to take my child that is going to be, you know, on vacation or something. I need to take them to go do something. <laughs> they can't go back to school and be like, they didn't do nothing. <laughs> <laughs> that type of energy. So again, like I said, I definitely feel that you guys are just unapologetically being Leo's the way you, you guys are. Like, I definitely see you guys definitely doing that. And here we go. The eight of pentacles. Again, like I said, a lot of opportunities in regards to finances and in regards to financial stability. I definitely do see you guys working extremely hard towards your goals, towards attaining those goals. And I feel that for June, I want to say the second week of June, you start seeing the manifestations. You start seeing that opportunity. You start seeing that your supervisor is coming to you and telling you, good job, Leo. I'm so proud of you. Or you know what, Leo, we have an, a position that is available. You should apply to it or whatnot. All of these opportunities are going to start to quickly start to come for you for June. And you're not afraid to take those opportunities, but also you're not afraid to, you know, if it comes to your children, if it comes to spending time with your family or your lover, you're going to definitely not hesitate about saying, you know what, I put effort Monday through Friday, but this Saturday I got to take it off because I need to recharge or something like that. I definitely see all of that uh, for the month of June. And I, I, it makes me so excited because this is definitely your energy, Leo. And I feel that you guys start to see very quick movement in the month of June. So that's beautiful, beautiful for you guys. I'm so excited for you guys. So uh, like, share, and comment. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, definitely subscribe. And I will see you guys Friday.